so here we're gonna see how we're gonna import any city that you want inside of blender and work with the 3d landscape so what you wanna do is first you wanna get some software so get into google and type what i do render doc and go to other builds so we wanna get a specific version of render doc and a specific version of blender for this to work so i'll tell you exactly what you need so let the site load and go to stable builds and get version 1.25 and get the installer i've already installed this but i just want to show you guys what you guys should get and uh make sure you install the installer uh and make sure you select the correct version so once this opens up go into um file and click on inject into process and you'll see that something written in red so just ignore it we need something else so what you want to do is if you have a google chrome shortcut on your desktop right click and go into properties and select all inside target and paste whatever i have pasted i'll leave it as a link uh, or as a text in the description of this video so you'll see that the google chrome icon changes into something like a terminal window or something like that so double click on it you'll see it has a certain pid go back into render doc and click on refresh and then you can see the google chrome process so double click it and open it like this and go back to google doc sorry google chrome click on ok and you'll see that a chrome window opens up so go into maps.google.com again and what you have to do is click on the layers tab and click on globe view so that way you can see the 3d view of whatever you search for or scroll like wherever you go inside of google maps you can see it inside of like a 3d view so let's just go somewhere where there is a good geography of um, of a good city what will i pick let's see australia new zealand jakarta hmm let's just go inside of jakarta and see the thing is some cities don't have a good geography inside of um, maps map data is insufficient or the buildings aren't quite you know 3D. He says, let's go to London. So I'll bet London has a good geographical 3D view. So yeah, as you can see, I can see the city of London quite accurately, I must say. And to generate a 3D model of this, what you gotta do is go back and click on capture, go back again, come back again, you'll see that it has been saved. Voila. Right click on it and click on save, give it whatever name you want save it in whatever location you want and click on save so after this you have to download something that you require as an add-on in blender to import that rdc file into blender so go into this link i'll leave this in the description so this is something important that you have to see the version of this must be compatible with the render doc version and the blender version so i'm using blender 3.4 and render doc 1.25 for this particular video so you can download maps more uh, models importer version 0.6.2 click on the zip file and download it and now you have your add-on now what you would do is open blender and install this add-on inside of your blender to import the rdc file that you saved earlier so just delete this cube go into edit preferences add-ons and click on install so i have already installed this so just click on the file and click on install add-on and then type here maps and just click on the checkbox so that you enable the add-on give it a location instead of your hard drive click on the close button uh, go into file go into import go into rdc and go into the directory that you saved your rdc file minus london click on import wait for a few seconds for it to generate the 3d model and 
there you have it you have the 3d view of of London as you can see so the lighting is a bit tough let me change the view so here you can see it is quite um, detailed but if you zoom in the details are very less so there is something that we can do to improve these details so I'll leave that to a, a later video but for now this is something that you can work with so leave a like and hit comment if you like this video goodbye